SpaceX's Starship rocket launched from Texas but encountered significant issues during its flight, failing to meet key testing objectives and presenting new engineering challenges for CEO Elon Musk's Mars ambitions. The 400-foot, 122-meter Starship system lifted off from SpaceX's Starbase, marking the ninth full test mission since the program's inception in April 2023. This launch was notable for being the first to reuse a super heavy booster, demonstrating the potential for reusability. However, the mission faced setbacks when SpaceX lost contact with the 232 foot lower stage booster during its descent, which ended in a crash into the Gulf of Mexico instead of a controlled splashdown. Meanwhile, the upper stage of Starship reached suborbital space but began to spin uncontrollably about 30 minutes into the flight. This erratic behavior followed the failure of a mechanism designed to deploy eight mock Starlink satellites, leading to further complications. The mission concluded with both the booster and upper stage being lost, as the upper stage disintegrated during re-entry over the Indian Ocean due to a fuel tank leak and a malfunctioning payload door. Despite these failures, SpaceX views the data collected as crucial for refining the Starship system. Musk has indicated plans to expedite the testing schedule, with the Federal Aviation Administration FAA, approving up to 25 launches and 50 landings annually. The Starship program remains central to SpaceX's objectives of facilitating human missions to the Moon and Mars, as well as supporting NASA's Artemis program. Continued testing and iteration are anticipated as the company strives to achieve a fully reusable launch system.